Alright, and welcome to game one of series one of the Mario Sluggers League playoffs. We currently have the Bows versus the Monsters, the one versus the four seed. We'll see if the Monsters can pull an upset here. And we have an immediate bean ball as Monty Mole is the first one up to bat in his first appearance this season and actually in the history of the league. He's already made it to second. Bowser Jr. with the RBI chance for Monty Mole. And Monty Mole is stealing third. He's going to make it to third. In Monty Mole's first appearance in the league, he's already on third base. This is quite the shocker. Oh, and Monty Mole heading home. It's a close play. <laughs> he wins the close play. <laughs> Monty Bull bringing in his first score and the first score of the game. Oh my. <laughs> That'll be strike three for Dark Bones. But now we have Bowser up to bat with runners on first and second. That's going to go foul to the right. The old Magic Koopa is stealing third, but that's going to go high into the left field and caught by Petey. Third out, and we're changing sides. Monsters managed to score one in the first. <laughs> Maybe this will give them a chance at winning this game. The old Magic Koopa is going to be the first to pitch for the Monsters. Normally we see Toadsworth get the start, but changing it up today, I see. And Toadette hits it deep right field. Bowser Jr. is going to grab it, but she gets the first. The whooper up to bat. Good eye. Makes contact with this one, sends it deep left field, but Dark Bones catches it, sends it back to the first. But Toadette manages to make it back. She's safe. Petey's up to bat. Two strikes for Petey. Oh. And the Magic Group's signature pitch gets Petey on the third strike. Wiggler hoping that he can advance Toadette. Toadette's stealing second, but she rethinks that, heads back to first. Toads are trying to chase her down. Strike two for Wiggler. Strike three, and he is out. We'll be changing sides. And through the first, the bows are held scoreless, giving the monsters a 1-0 lead. Something we have not seen this season. <laughs> the, the monsters GM pointing out that this may be his first lead of the entire season. Oh, and the goat hits a deep right field, but that's going to go foul. Strike two for the goat. He hits that one foul. You know the goat can't strike out. Hits that deep center field, and Wiggler's gonna grab it. Well, I was right. It didn't strike out. Blue Pianta hitting this deep, but this is gonna go right to Blooper, and we'll be changing sides. Bows coming up in the bottom of the second, hoping that they can tie the score. We're going to have a pitching change? Toadsworth is coming in. The monster's getting serious now. And that ball goes all the way to Cuba. Strike two for Daisy. Or strike one, by the way. Two balls, two strikes. A little trickery on that one. That's going to get Daisy struck out. Strike one for baby DK. Toesworth faked him out, gets a strike two. And strike three. Toesworth feeling mighty proper after that. Two strikes for Birdo. Toes was so far looking like he has this on lock. 
his signature pitch. Full count. Let's see what happens now. Strike three. Three up, three down for the bows. And we have Monty Mole up to bat. It might be over for the bows right now. The monster's just coming to play. This goes right past Daisy and Monty Mole making it to first. So far, he's been the X Factor for the. Never mind. Oh, Magic Koopa able to make it to first. So Bowser Jr., it has the distance. Can they perform the buddy jump in time? Two run home run! The monsters take a commanding 3 0 lead. It is the playoffs. Anything could happen, but we were definitely not expecting this. That's an out at first. We're up to two outs now. Monster's hoping they can keep this streak going. Dark Bones with two strikes. Makes contact with that. It goes fair. Oh my. Oh. Birdo is tired. She has never been tired this early, but that's going to be the third out caught by Peach. Birdo will have to sit the fourth, so this could be big for the monsters. Toadette hoping to continue his streak from last inning. Peach able to make contact with that one. That goes to deep center field. Now get her to first. Toad up the bat. He swings and a miss. Peach is stealing second. Toad hits it. That's going to advance Peach to second. Toad's going to make it to first. Toadette up to bat, and Peach is stealing third. Yo, Magic Koopa is going to get it, and that's going to be the out at first, but Toad and Peach both advance a base. Blooper is swinging a miss. He makes contact this one. He goes deep left. Oh, it might. Is this going to have the distance? Three. Three run home, home run by Blooper. And just like that, the monster's lead is gone. It is now three to three. <laughs> monster's GM is off his high now. Petey hits it right over second base. That's gonna be good enough to get him to first. Good eye by Wiggler there. Deep left field, but it's going to be caught by Dark Bones. PD head making his way back to first, and he'll be safe. Oh, and Toadsworth is tired, so he's going to have to sit the fourth. It's a swing and a miss by Daisy, but it, but PD steals second. PD's trying to steal third, and he rethinks that. Oh! And he makes it all the way a third after a mess up by the infielders. They cannot be happy about that one. But is Toadsworth able to strike out Daisy and we're going to get a change sides. And now after the third and head into the fourth, the score is tied at three to three. Oh, Birdo accidentally charges up. She'll throw a ball here. Oh, or or she will throw a strike. So we do have an illegal pitch, but we'll, now we'll have a change in pitchers. It looks like we are going to see Peach coming in. Two immediate balls from Peach. Ooh, and she nearly hits toes with that one. And Tozo strikes out. The goat with one strike. And that goes through the goat's head. But he ends up making contact and setting it deep center field. He'll get to first. 
as expected from him. Blue Pianta sends it right to Toadette, and that's going to be a double play. Three outs. The Bows are hoping to continue their scoring from the bottom of the third and retake a lead. Toad's just going to throw a ball because he needs to be switched out. <laughs> We're going to see Monty Mole coming into pitch. So far, he's done pretty well for the Monsters in his debut. Let's see if he can continue that on the mound. They're throwing absolute heat. And he's going to get a strikeout on his first batter. Monty Mole may just be the X Factor in this game. Lobs that one up. That's going to go foul for Birdo. Th three strikes and she is out. Two strikeouts for Monty Mole. Peach makes contact and she's going to make it to first. Toad hits this one all the way back to the train tracks. Peach is going to go for third. Can he get it before the train? And he does. Peach heading home. And she makes it all the way home. The bows are going to take a lead. The monsters were lucky and were able to just barely get that past the train. Otherwise, we may have seen two runs there. Oh, and Monty Mole being taken out after getting two strikeouts? Monster GM just wasn't feeling it, I guess. Toadette hitting this deep left, but it's going to be caught by Dark Bones. And the monster is able to hold the boats to only one run. This game is still within their reach. And Monty Mole is going to be up to bat. Oh, and Birdo just nabbing that one. The old Magic Koopa with two strikes. And he hits this one right in between second and third. He's going to make it to first. Bowser Jr. up to bat. Swing and a miss. He watches that one, but it goes right over the plate. And strike three for Bowser Jr. We have two outs now with a runner on first. Oh, and Peach is going to grab that, throw it to second, and we'll be having a change of sides. And after a hot start from the Monsters, it looks like the Bows are retaking their dominance. And this game could be over if the Bows score any more in this inning. Toadsworth is going to come back in to pitch. Oh, nope, never mind. Bowser Jr. coming in. And they're going to send Monty out to the outfield. <laughs> Blooper hits this right to Toadsworth. That's going to be an out at first. PD watches that one. It's a ball. Takes a swing at this one. That's going to go foul. Bowser Jr. doing a pirouette out on the mound. It's going to be a strike two, though. I guess the pirouette is too distracting for the batters as he gets a strikeout on PD. Wiggler with a swing and a miss. Oh, and another one. Makes contact with this one, but this is going to be caught. And change sides. Bowser Jr. able to hold the bows in that inning, stopping the scoring from the previous two innings. Monsters need to try and score in this inning so that they don't have to score in the seventh. Dark Bones hits this one. It's going to go foul. And it's going to be a strikeout for Dark Bones. Peach done well so far for the Bows. Bowser hitting this deep left field. Home run from Bowser. <laughs> it didn't go over the fence, but I guess they're going to give it to him. Bowser hopping his way home. Oh, my. It's tied 4-4 four to four now with only one out. Toadsworth hits this, and it goes right past Daisy. He's going to make it to first. 
the goat hoping to send Toadsworth home. But he hits it right to Daisy, and that's probably gonna. Oh, never mind. He's safe at first. Toadsworth does get out, though. Pianta hits this right over second. And he's gonna advance the goat to second. Oh, Monty Mole hoping for that RBI. Two strikes. But he hits it. And that's gonna be an out at first. The monsters are able to tie, though. This is, that's pretty big, as we're heading into the bottom of the six. If they can hold the both scoreless here, they might have a shot at winning this game. <laughs> Slugger of the year, Daisy up to bat first though. That was quite the shock for most of us to see that. Daisy stealing second. Well, that's gonna go foul, so she'll have to head back to first. She's giving another shot, and she rethinks her decision as Yellow Magic Koopa just chasing her down. That's gonna go right over second base. That's gonna advance Daisy to second. Baby DK makes it to first. No outs and runners on first and second. Daisy stealing third, and she is once again rethinking her decision. <laughs> She's not going to give it another go as Birdo hits it high. Can the train get there in time or will they catch it? Oh, the train gets there in time. That's going to send Daisy home. Baby DK to third. He might. He's going to hold up at third. And the Bows are going to take a one point lead here with runners on second and third with no outs. This could be bad for the monsters. The train just screwing them over. Peach hitting this right on the left line. That's going to send Baby DK home and... And Birdo. This could be the end of the game here as the Bows are going to take a three-point lead. The train just always seems to get the monsters. And once again, it strikes here in the game one of the playoffs. Toad is going to hit this right foul. And a beanball by Bowser Jr. And he'll be coming out after that one. The monster's just not happy with his performance after allowing for three runs. Toadsworth is tired, so he'll have to sit the seventh. The goat managing to make a catch. And he gets the double play at second. This is why he is the goat. Blooper making contact with that one. It's going to go all the way to the train tracks, and we're, we might see Toad heading home, and yes, we do. Can he make it? He does. That extends the lead to four. <laughs> Looking pretty happy with himself after that one. A little tricky from Toadsworth on that one. Strike one. Strike two. And strike three. The monster is able to stop the bleeding after allowing four runs in the sixth. Now, if they don't score four here in the top of the seventh, the game will end. Let's see what they can do. And that's a good start for them as Yell Magic Coop is going to make it to first. Wiggler missing that one. Strike two for Bowser Jr. And strike three. Peach is finally tired after playing almost the entire game. It's going to go foul to the right. Yo, Magic Koopa stealing second. And we're going to have an out at first, but Yo, Magic Koopa does make it a second. Two outs and a runner on second for Dark Bones. Stealing third. And the bows are just going to allow him to get there. Oh, close play. Oh, that was big by Yellow Magic Koopa as he gets to home. Dark Bones making it to second. The, the deficit is only three now with Bowser up to bat. Strike two. And he hits that right to Birdo at first and she's going to get the out. That's going to be the ball game. 
it was quite the fight put up the, by the monsters in this game, something we haven't seen all season. We might see a game being stolen in this series. <laughs> the monsters really do not like the tray, as I'm being told by their GM currently. Now let's take a look at who won MVP and what the box score was. And as expected, Peach taking the MVP as she just pitched the lights out after the third in inning. All around decent scoring by the monsters. But Peach just dominating with 105 points. And well, that's going to do it for game one of the playoffs here in the Mario Sluggers League. I'm Tucker, and I'll see you next time.